As classrooms share and writing tables not day, small picking them, not they learn other traits for some public primary schools inside Barano State. This report shows plenty of the palaver. The primary schools in Barono State is faced with inadequate trained teachers, poor school infrastructure and inadequate teaching and learning facilities. In some of the primary schools in the state capital, Meduguri, classes are overcrowded with about 200 to 150 people in a single classroom. The pupils are forced to sit on the bare floor for lessons and using their legs as writing desks, while some others learn under a neem tree. Uh, it affects learning. Yara Buddha, the leader, Hamsin, Malami, at least forty to fifty at Kim class. Malami, they are controlling Yara Zasuya Suzona, Suji Abunda, Malami, Eke Magana. Kazona, a chicky choose. One night to take a one night to take a cosa casa hankali abunda marami a pada. Eh? When you want to buy the interest, they do it abaca. Eh? Buze yaro, buze ya comi iliminsa. Comi himmansa. Ye doki agum maramina. When is a sokeneshi? Buze ya yo query yenda de yara arbain, coham sin suzona a queer musu. Bazai ya kwaya ba yara suna zaune a kasa benchi bai sai su ba za ka ji ka samu classes 30 40 a cikin makarantan bazai wuce class 10 ko 15 suna da seat ba sauran duka suna a kasa this is despite the huge resources and attention allocated to education in the state both by government and non-government organizations on the 24th of December 2018, former Borno State Governor Kasim Shatima presented a budget of over 24 billion naira for education in the proposed 2019 budget. And about 2.227 billion naira was allocated for universal basic education, a body responsible for providing basic amenities in primary schools. The 2019 budget size is less than that of last year by 56 billion. 204,000, representing about 30.80% reduction. This is in view of our desire to have a realistic budget. In pursuance of this objective, government in the coming year intends to establish an agency to be known as Borno State Mega Schools Management Board. The primary objective of this agency is to, among other things, set standards. The 2.227 billion naira budget was for the construction and rehabilitation of schools infrastructure destroyed by the Boko Haram insurgents, procurement of furniture, computers, photocopying machines, teaching and learning materials, as well as vehicles. Plus TV Africa crew visited about five primary schools within the state capital while using a hidden camera to record the condition in those schools as journalists are not allowed to use an open device to record since it is against the rules of the civil service for a public servant to talk to newsmen. Some officials were however captured lamenting the neglect in the primary school's education sector. According to these officials, there are indeed high syndicates of corrupt government officials who pocketed the money meant for improving the standards of education in primary schools. In one of the primary schools visited, there was indeed a computer room, but only one out of the ten computer desktops were working. 
We further tracked down Marla, who has just retired from service in March 2019 after working for 30 years. He shares his years of teaching experiences with us and the challenges teachers and pupils face in public schools. I computer at King Magarantunda Neke Koyroba and Massam Promaris. Soon at a computer at King Metropolitan. There be soon at a computer room. Muntaba Zua Munshi Gamugani Muni won't so Aikima Achiki. A ma Adi Magarantan and Neke Koyroba. Banga Alama computer. However, the chairman of the Universal Basic Education Board, Dr. Shetima Kulima, says the overcrowded schools may not be unconnected with the mass influx of people from rural communities chased by the Boko Haram insurgents. He further added that not all that was mentioned in the budget was given to the board, as it was what was proposed, but not what was realized. It's a budget for the year, not for the ICT, mind you. Is that is a budget? And then budget can be, can be just a projection. It's not the total sum are available for you to use, just a projection. When money comes, you can apply and get it. Sometimes, depending on the need, when the need is not only just computers and what have you, if, if classrooms are not there, what, what is the essence for you to look for computers? You can also, you say this, should go to construction of classroom because it is very important than the computer now. What is the way forward to achieving quality education in Borno State, one would ask. Malam Gamdu has the following suggestion. In the Yara, Bode Wuchi Arbain, Talatin, Koham Sin, the Yawan Shikena, Kuan Yaro Yesamu, Wajan Zama. The benching she, yezona mekeo, in the duk mala mizaya ya controlling ya. And will these be met? It remains to be questioned.